guys, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Monique and today I have a tag video for you and this tag was created by LB. Um, it's choosing a handbag for every occasion tag, which I think it's such an interesting tag to do. There's six categories to this tag. You're supposed to choose only one handbag for each category which I find very challenging because each category like like each bag can work for you know a few categories so before we start I am wearing my Chanel necklace that I scored from the Chanel sale this is from the Cuba collection I was so so happy when I found this during the sale it's just so amazing I will link that video down below of the unboxing if you would like to watch that and don't forget to click subscribe I would really appreciate it if you do so the choosing a uh, handbag for every occasion tag as I mentioned it, it was created by LB and there's six categories casual work travel evening day to night and minimum I think it is a really helpful tag because it kind of narrows down your handbag collection in a way because for one category you might have several bags option and then you start thinking to yourself why do I have so many options for one function you know maybe it starts maybe it's time for me to start getting rid of some items and be more selective about my collection I mean I always strive to be <laughs> selective and to have such an edited collection but also I am such a bag lover that it is so difficult to do but anyway so the first one is casual so for casual I choose my Gucci lady web bag in canvas with the web strap I just love the web strap I think web strap is super casual this is something that would go with like a white t-shirt and jeans that's literally what I want to wear in the city uh, it's so hectic that I just want like to dress basic and casually but you know still looks decent so I think putting a bag like this on jeans and t-shirt make you look a little bit you know made up somewhat but in a very casual way this is perfect for spring summer because of the canvas and you know the color I just love how classy this bag is and monogram is back um, Dior is actually releasing a lot of the 1970s Trotter canvas um, bags and it's the original canvas that they use in the 1970s and they're selling it now so I think Dior is going to be the next one that people will be hunting the vintage for so this is my casual and then the second is for work I don't work in an office so I don't really need to wear a structured bag or a very serious bag but I do like to carry my laptop because I like to work when I'm in the store I like to work on you know editing and stuff like that so I'm gonna choose my Balenciaga city bag because it fits my laptop it is so comfortable and I wear it all the time to go to work lately and I used to wear the vintage Louis Vuitton Gobelin backpack but I have to squeeze in the laptop, you know, so much and it doesn't really carry a lot because it's such a structured bag. And this one fits my um, laptop, my medium agenda, and then uh, notebooks and all my essentials. So if you want a video on what fits in my work bag, let me know down below. But this is what I choose for my work bag. And thinking about this category, I also have the Proenza Schooler PS1 bags, which I haven't been wearing a lot because I gravitate towards the city bag more. Now I'm thinking maybe I should sell that bag because, you know, you don't need bags lying around and you don't use it at all. That's just money goes to waste. Anyway, for travel, I used to have this Balenciaga crossbody kind of like a bucket bag that I use for travel because it fits a lot but now I think this is going to be my travel bag I'm super 
casual airport outfit usually I'm always in like something super comfortable so and also like sometimes travel to areas that is not a good idea to be wearing um, like monograms and logo all over so this is perfect for me when traveling to like diff those kind of countries and it's just like a black Balenciaga backpack I think this might be originally men's but I think it's unisex and I wear a lot of men's stuff so it's just a black backpack it's canvas it's so comfortable it has leather trim it's literally you know a lifesaver having a backpack and just be careful because you know everything is in your back what I usually do is like I put all my essential here and then have maybe like a small kind of walk style kind of bag to have my passport and my wallet stay close to my body and if they ever complain about that that I just I would just put that bag in this backpack so you can make sure that your you know all the important documents that you have is secured and safe and you can put that in this backpack so this is definitely my travel companion more on just the traveling but not really when you already reach the city I don't travel around the city with a backpack because that's not I don't think that's the smartest thing to, to do um, also you don't need this much stuff when you're wandering around and exploring a new city anyway so this is more for the airport okay and evening bag I think any Chanel would be suitable as an evening bag but of course I have to choose that for another category I usually wear a clutch for evening but I guess this is a handbag tag so I'm gonna choose a handbag um, I'm going to choose my Lady Dior. This is a vintage Lady Dior bag. Um, it comes with a strap, but uh, for evening, I wouldn't be using the strap. I would just wear it like this because I think top handle bag is so elegant for evening. And it's just a little bit more dressy as opposed to something that is crossbody or on your shoulder. So this is for the evening. The next one is day to night. So for day to night, I would choose the Chanel medium double flap bag. This is obviously a bag for every occasion. It could be any day occasion, night occasion. I could be going around during the day running my errands in this and then go for a drink with friends at night and I'll still be okay. And uh, I think the beige is perfect for spring summer and the black is perfect all year long. And I think this is just such a great, if you only have one bag or one only one designer bag, then this would be it. So this is my day tonight. The last category is minimal. I think it means when you just don't really want to carry a lot of stuff with you. But that's pretty much like almost every day for me. Uh, if I don't have to bring my laptop, I would just like have my small wallet, my, you know, a uh, key pouch that has my key and my metro card, you know, a, lip, a little bit of lipstick or lip gloss and I'm good to go. And I usually have my sunglasses on me or like just, I would just like hang it on my shirt. So for something like that, I like the mini, either rectangular or square. They both are pretty similar in terms of what they can fit in. I'm going to choose this one because again it goes with so many colors. My uh, sh like mini s square is in burgundy. It might be perfect for fall winter or certain type of colors but the black one would be perfect for any day, any season and it is pretty small so you can only carry that much with you. So like a wallet, your phone, your keys lipstick and you're good to go this is perfect for running errand because it is a cross body so your hands will be free and you'll be um, free to walk around the city so yeah that is my minimal bag that is all the six categories of this tag um, thank you so much for watching and thank you to LB for creating this fun tag. I hope you guys also try this tag. I would like to tag everyone who wants to do this. 
um because it's fun i i love watching all these tags and let me know if you don't want to do the video you can comment down below the kind of bags that you have like you want for these categories or what you think is appropriate for the categories so yeah thank you so much for watching guys i hope you enjoyed the video don't forget to click subscribe and i'll see you next time bye